It's almost time to get this one underway. Japan starts with it. Shinozaki. Quick move to the right. Speaking of quick, Mayamamoto. A little strong on the shot. Mawuli cleans things up and gets the layup to fall. Japan strikes first. Here come Ukraine, your 2016 silver medalist. Ruliova elevates. Uh-uh. Mawuli laid the smack down. Here's Shinozaki, drops it off, Mawuli, hoop and a harm, strong bucket. 22 years old, but she is a seasoned veteran. Great composure on the shot made. You saw the previous make as well. Putting a little extra sauce on it, so it goes down easy. Can she get the free throw to go down? Not this time. This is Ukraine's strength. They can get it done on the inside. Ryova does not do it that time. She also cannot track the loose ball down. So Shubik will check in. She'll be on the court with Olhovic and Ryova. They'll have to contend with the speed of, Jap of uh, Japan. You see Japan run this action a lot right around the perimeter. And Yamamoto. Wet like a skinny dipper. Four zip. Yamamoto kicks it cross court. Shinozaki. She couldn't double down from the corner. Stays where it's at. 4 1. But Yamamoto, all she needs is a glimmer, just a glimpse. She's going to let that thing fly. Look at the flick of the wrist. Next time you see it, it's going through the bottom of the nets. Three-point lead, Japan, right out of the gates. Filovic, Ruliova, using that size. Whoa, wow. Oh, what a shot. That was a no-look shot. Shinozaki, drive, kick, up thing. What a thing of beauty. Uh, teamwork making the dream work for Japan. And their dreams of making it to the Olympic Games are going to get even stronger with a win here. And almost assuredly give them a spot in the quarterfinals if they move to 3 0. Shubik, good drive, she misses it. Filovich, point blank, same result, Yamamoto. She'll swing it. Shinozaki, jab step. Now Mawuli. She changes direction, steps through, puts it up with the left hand. She is multi-talented. Ambidextrous. I'll call for the foul right there. Whistleblow, 6-2, Team Japan leading over Team Ukraine. Yamamoto, defending, too slow on the run out. She got splashed on, 6-4. to four. And Nishioka, no, got a hat on, Ruliova. She lost her bearings there, stepped on the out-of-bounds line. Ball over to Japan, who lead this thing by two. This Japanese offensive attack is keyed by Ma Yamamoto, who led all scores on day one with 23 points through a couple of games. Shinozaki trying to get in on the action as well, but her mid-range J is a miss. Ruliova, not happening for her either. Oh, Shinozaki, oh yeah, she is hacked in the process of the shot. Shinozaki 
averaging about three points per game so far here in Graz. She doesn't have to do a whole lot of scoring on this team. Doesn't mean that she cannot do it. Seven to four is where we stand right now. They want to know. Yamamoto was going to knock it down. There's the answer. He missed it. Now she's in trouble. Loyola. Quick score. See the transition offense. Yamamoto quick to the corner and also quick to the crib. The only speed she knows is faster. Forget fast. The only speed she knows is faster. Faster than you are. 8-5. You know what I'm y'all? So who out here Again. is cheering for and Team Japan? Make some noise for Team Japan, y'all. She was flawless in Japan's start. Again, a perfect 2-0 record. They picked up their first win over Australia, 21-15. That was a signature W over that Australian team. Then they dis then they uh, picked up a blowout win, 22 to four. So we get back to it. Mawuli, patient on the shot attempt. Good strong interior defense. Filevic, leading scorer for this Ukrainian team. She comes into this one with 12 points. And they're running out of time. Shinozaki passes it to Mawuli. Space. Wooly. And a little short one on one. It's tough to stop. Nine to five. Mawuli back to Shinozaki. Shinozaki puts it up from behind that two point line. She's just slightly off the mark. Yamamoto, good hustle. A good D. Filevich, is she feeling it? No. Mawuli. She'll secure the rebound. My Yamamoto gives it up quickly. Very few wasted actions with this Japanese team. Yamamoto, he couldn't get the short J to go. Ukraine ball. Ukraine quickly down to Filevich. Yamamoto put her hands in the cookie jar. She's got a treat. A little give and go. Kick ball is the only thing that stopped it. See the off ball foul. Yeah, really over. Trying to get away with a the grab there. Nine, five, two, that might be the only way you can hold my Yamamoto. Is to hold her physically. Oh. Nice shoulder fake. Shioka couldn't get the sky hook to go down, so it stays a four point game. Ukraine, can they respond from the corner? No. Yoga couldn't cash it in. Yamamoto. Oh, set the table. She is a helper. That was helpful. So was that for Ukraine. Yoga bottoms up. 10 7 contest. They came to play. Yeah, Foul on the shot. Looked like a clean block initially, but there was contact down below. Shubik will check out. Filevich and Mayamamoto will step up to the strike and shoot one here. Her team leading by three. Again, day one's leading score with 23 points, including that game clincher against Australia. And the free throw is good as well. Olhovic. Oh, good defense as well. Way to play the passing lanes. Olhova. Fader. No. Sticks with it. A couple times. A few times. Filevich. Can she make it count from deep? No. Olhova, though, doing a good job to keep it alive. She turns and shoots. And it goes off the front of the 10. Yamamoto, her pass stolen. 
A little bit sloppy with the ball, both teams here. Now Loyola going to that drop step game, and now she gets it to go down. It's a one possession contest. Ukraine ain't going nowhere. Yamamoto lets it go. And too much sauce on that one. Fourth ranked Japanese team trying to hold off Ukraine. And Shubik could have tied things up. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. Oh, nice little team they go with a whistle No basket. Official Vlad says holding blue. Shubik got the whistle. 11 and 9 is where, is where it stands. So we can get into that Japanese huddle. All right. Got the fans Liddy up in here. Safely, of course. Got the mask on. Oh! Shinozaki nearly had an and one. Instead, she'll get to shoot two free throws. That is foul number seven on Ukraine. That puts them in the penalty. Shinozaki. Good on the first two. So she gets two shots and the second one, same result. Money as well. 13 9. Foul on Mawuli. Only the fourth on Japan. Three thirty five and counting. First of 21, 10 minute sprint. Velevich had the step on Yamamoto, but she couldn't close the deal. Mawuli, she comes uh, to set the screen. Yamamoto, high arc on the shot, but it's off the mark. Had missed a whole lot out here in Brock. Oh, Ruliova. Pure water from Rodiova. Two point game. So Japan not able to get rid of Ukraine easily in this one. Yamamoto bottoms 15 11. Shinozaki, good D. Nishioka to Yamamoto. To the block. Oh, the layup missed. Good opportunity there. Japan would like to go back to that. Oh, oh, Vic. She doubles down from the left wing. And here we are with 228 to play, 15 to 13. Japan really being tested here. We saw what they did against a, a very tough Australian team in a 21 to 15 win. This game proving to be even tougher than that one with 2:22 to play. This time Nishioka held up, and an eighth foul on Ukraine. Foul situation coming back to to bite them. If Nishioka can capitalize at the strike. First free throw, splash. So Nishioka penalizes them in the penalty. That's the only way to do it is to make it count. Second free throw, and her catch. fundamentals are sound. The free throw game. 17-13. Good. 17-13. Off of it. Same spot. Wobbity, wobbity, drop, drop it. Like 
Corbin. Oh, damn and again. All of it Marcus. is starting to feel it right now. Something like a full body massage. Back to back twos. She's on a four point run all by herself, and she's single handedly keeping Ukraine in this game. Two oh eight in a seventeen fifteen contest. Japan only slightly in front. All her big. Oh, she lost the handle on that. Wasted possession. Now they're gonna have to stop the Japanese attack. They lead by two. Two minutes remaining ball game. Shinozaki left her stuck in place. But she couldn't finish the layup. Alkovic tracks it down. Ulyova up top. Filevic, can she tie things up? She goes off the window and it's 17 all. Great game. Setting up to be a photo finish with a buck 41 to play as we start day three's action officially here with the ladies in group B. Ukraine's foul situation, though, could loom large here. That puts Mawuli back on the free throw line. And if there's one area of her game that has needed a little improvement, it is her free throw shooting. And she misses the first of two. She's got another chance here. And the second free throw, she makes good on it. She slips. And Filevich, same spot, different result. Rolyova would have had an easy layup, but what a recovery block from Ma Wooly. She is all effort all the time and saved a potential tie in layup as Rolyova has it swatted away. 11 seconds left on the shot clock. Now Ukraine's got to get back to business. Filevich, Olkovic, that's a, that's a foul white. A fifth on Japan. They got one more to give. Olkovic. Filevich. She's got Rulyova coming around. She'd be coming around the mountain when she comes. But she can't get the two to go down. Eh? It's going to be blue ball. Still plenty of time. No need to panic for either team, really. Minute 23 remaining in this one. Ruliova. She likes her chances down here against Nishioka. Missed it. That's a whole white. I saw that. Yeah, Nishioka was grabbing the arm of, of Ruliova. You can look again. That's the 16th foul on Japan, so they got no more to give. Next defensive foul in Ukraine to shoot free throws. Again, that charity stripe is going to loom large here this final minute and 15 seconds. Filevich, she changes direction. You won't get a better look than that. Didn't get the result. Filevich misses as well. Look at my Wooly getting down there. She's not afraid to get unruly. Shinozaki now. Six on the shot clock. Will you over in front of her? But for how long? Shinozaki pull up on you. 19-17. Still a one possession game. Filevich can even things up with the two. For the foul call. Offensive foul. So yeah, tough go at it on that possession. Timeout white. Ukraine also in the double penalty. They won't be shooting free throws because that was an offensive foul, but it is the 10th foul, which means next defensive foul, not only will Japan be shooting two free throws, they'll get the ball. Let's listen in.
All right, Mawuli. So start the possession. 40 seconds left. They do the three-woman weave outside the perimeter. They love that handoff action. Meantime, Yamamoto gone in a blink. You might have missed her. 20 to 17, Mawuli. Girl by. Swat on the inside. Ball back in the hands of the Japanese. They got game point here. And Ukraine had their opportunities here, but it looks like it's going to be, no, it's not over with. Not yet. Shinozaki, she's got the ball back. They're going to try to drain the clock here. A smart decision. And Ukraine has opted not to foul. And they're going to suffer their second loss. The Shinozaki doesn't get to that 21 point mark, but they do get to 20. And it is a 20 to 17 win. Japan over Ukraine. A good way to start day three. Again, officially. Great effort, both teams. But only one could come out of the smoke in this one. And it is Japan.